What's up, everybody? It's Josh coming at you from Nerdvengers Tower, and it may have finally happened, ladies and gentlemen. I may have met a scoop I didn't want to know about. I talk about a lot of scoops, rumors, leaks for different projects out there. This one is massive. You can see it on the thumbnail. You can see it in the title. Amelia Clark's identity in the Secret Invasion show appears to have leaked out. Okay, so I want to talk about this and I want to explain why this is such a big deal and why I think this may be a bridge too far when it comes to leaking and, and scooping out these sort of things. Uh, and it actually is unique to the kind of show that Secret Invasion is and the kind of comic book story that it was. But before uh, all of that, let's explain what is exactly going on. What's the deal with this scoop? I'm over on murphysmultiverse.com, and uh, Murphy uh, Charles actually wrote this himself. Pretty wild. Um, basically, this has to do with My Time to Shine Hello. It says here, uh, though plenty of set photos and videos have captured during its production, much of Secret Invasion has stayed a secret. Samuel L. Jackson, Ben Mendelsohn, Colby Smulders are all reprising their respective MCU roles in the MCU Disney Plus streaming series. But little is known about who the rest of the cast will be playing in the Paranora paranoia thriller uh olivia coleman kingsley ben adir christopher mcdonald and killian scott have all been cast in undisclosed roles but no member of the cast has drawn more interest and generated more speculation than amelia clark fan theories have had her as everyone from jessica drew to abigail brand but now a rumor of uh, from a source who has proven reliable in the past points to a different direction and if you're hoping to avoid spoilers, turn away. According to the Reddit and Twitter scooper My Time to Shine Hello, Clark is portraying the, a character who played a major role in the Secret Invasion comic book event upon which the streaming series will be based. It says here, Amelia Clark is playing Varanki. Uh, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly or not, but she's the scroll queen, okay? She's the one that was Jessica Drew's uh, scroll in Secret Invasion, major part of that story. She's the scroll that Norman Osborn shoots to become uh, the sort of new hero of Earth, which leads him to the Dark Avengers, you know, that kind of a thing. And yeah, this is massive news. Now, there's, there's a lot of fun in what this could mean and the potential for her to play a role in further things. Maybe they'll not do the same ending. Uh, that was in the Secret Invasion comic book line, and I would venture to say they probably won't. And it's possible that she'll survive past that. She technically survives past that in the comics. Like, Norman, like, keeps her as a prisoner or something like that, right? Um, so there's a lot of fun to be had with this scoop, and I'm excited to see the show and how it all plays out, right? Here in this article, Charles is talking about how uh, in the comics, she was the Scroll Empress and mastermind of the Scroll Invasion of Earth. Varanki famously simmed Jessica Drew, aka Spider-Woman, and used her to sow discord among the Avengers in the period leading up to the invasion so or rather set footage from the uk showed clark's character in some facility with maria hill but also showed her seemingly working with ben adir's unknown scroll villain so while her identity as varanki is important it's only half the story the identity of her human character uh that she has chosen to sim will prove to be just as important to the plot of secret invasion so i think that there's something to be said for like still some mystery going on here but generally speaking you were probably going to see the human version of that character, and then this Varanki thing was going to be a big surprise. Like, I highly doubt this was going to be something the audience found out right away. Maybe I'm wrong, but the way I see it playing out is that part of the intrigue of a secret invasion story is who's a scroll. I mean, that was the whole thing in the comic books, right? Like, who was a scroll? And that intrigue is built into that material. And I think seeing who was ultimately going to be a scroll was going to be a major, major plot point. On top of that, the queen herself, the scroll queen, the head honcho, the one that's doing all of this, like that seems like it was going to be a pretty big twist. And trying to figure out who that character was or realizing that Amelia Clark was such a character of such importance would have been a really, really big mystery to be unraveled. Now, this might seem hypocritical because I talk about leaks and rumors and, and stuff all the time. But with this show specifically, with the intrigue that was supposed to be in there, and I think a lot of the value proposition of that, 
Unfortunately, I do think this is a bridge too far. Now, my time with Shana Lowe was teasing out a massive scoop. And you look, there's no way around it. This is a massive scoop. This is like, whoa, like it's crazy that you figured that out. Um, so, I mean, kudos to her. I am curious how the fan base will react to such a thing. And maybe this is just a little too far. I don't know, man. Like I pr practically know, you know, I, it's, it's sort of hard to parse out what's okay, what's not okay. But for whatever reason, this one's hitting me a little different. And I'm like, man, I just, I don't know. You know, I, I don't know if this was something that should be out there. Uh, I am sure we will talk about this more. I am sure that there will be a lot of fun to be had in the series itself. And I also will say that Feige sometimes, if a big thing leaks and it's not going to it's not going to be the end of the world if he changes it. He will actually change things because of big leaks like that. This sort of smells to me like something he could potentially change. It would be a shame for Amelia Clark if, like, because of this leak, they end up diminishing her role or changing it or doing something like that. Uh, and hopefully, there's still a lot of mystery with what other characters are scroll, et cetera, et cetera. And I'm still excited for it. And I love the MCU. And obviously, you know, leaks are not a problem for me personally, this one though, maybe something that should have been kind of kept out of the, the limelight. Maybe I'm wrong. You guys let me know what you think about it. Uh, we'll talk about it more in different streams and videos. And uh, yeah, it's out there now. So it is what it is. Uh, so yeah, let me know your thoughts. Smash a like on this video. As I always say, I hope you are having an awesome and a nerdy day. And I'll see you in the next video.